There are many different types of substances, plant, mineral and synthetic, that fall under the umbrella of home remedies. Among these are some of the more popular ones, the top 20 household healers. Before you try using any of them, make sure you understand the effects, any warnings regarding usage, and the specific dosage and application. Do understand the different strengths involved and the need to dilute essential oils. Never use a home remedy without being sure of the correct procedure. When in doubt, talk to a doctor or trained professional. That being said, here are the top 20 household healers and their more common uses. Aloe Vera Aloe Vera is one of the most popular skin care herbs. It is one of the very best skin remedies available. The plant is rich in anti-inflammatory compounds and contains bradykinase, a topical painkiller, magnesium lactate, which suppresses itching and other healing substances. The part of the plant used is the gel extracted from the leaf. Among the uses of aloe vera are the following. Minor burns, including sunburn, apply gel to soothe and heal cuts and scrapes, as the gel dries on the cut, it creates a natural bandage psoriasis, it softens the itchy skin scales and stops the inflammation acne, acts to ease the painful sores and helps to heal shingles, with an application of gel, the antiviral effects help speed up the healing process. As wonderful as aloe vera can be, there are precautionary notes. Do be sure to use for only minor not severe burns. The gel is for external use. Arnica Arnica contains a variety of chemical substances including helenolin and dihydrohelenolin, natural pain killers and anti-inflammatories. Common application is through a cream ointment or tincture. This daisy-like flower has a variety of possible uses, although most center on skin care. These include Bruises, reduces pain and swelling mild sprains and strains, relieves pain sore and tired feet, relieves and relaxes, soak in a foot bath. Arnica is a powerful herb. You only use it externally. It is toxic to ingest. If you have an allergy to other members of the this plant's compositee family, including asters and ragweed, do not use. It may produce a severe rash. There is a further caution considering usage. Never apply arnica to broken skin. It may be absorbed internally. Baking soda If there is one substance on this list that is both commonplace and versatile, it is baking soda. The full name, and contents of pure baking soda is sodium bicarbonate. It has a pH or 9 making it mildly alkaline. This makes it excellent in treating certain digestive orders. Besides making cookies and keeping your refrigerator smell fresh, you can use baking soda for any number of home remedies including. Heartburn, baking soda comprises the basis of many types of antacids toothpaste, baking soda can by itself be used to clean teeth. It is the ingredient of several brands of toothpaste feet, a footbath with dissolved baking soda puts your feet at ease and results in them smelling fresher armpits, baking soda as a natural deodorant stings and other itchy skin problems, baking soda as a paste or a wash helps to relieve the itch of insect bites as WEL is that of poison ivy and even chicken pox sunburn, a warm bath containing baking soda eases sunburn bladder infection, drinking baking soda and water eases the problem sore throat, water and baking soda Soda soothes a sore throat bad breath, gargling a combination of hydrogen peroxide and baking soda helps clear up bad breath. Baking soda is a wonderful product. It is indeed versatile. Yet, not everyone is able to use it. If you have high blood pressure problems, you should avoid using baking soda. Too much sodium will increase your blood pressure. Chamomile Chamomile is another popular herbal cure. It contains apigenin, a comative and bisabolol, an antispasmodic. It is anti-inflammatory and antiseptic. It also contains coumarin, an anticoagulant. You can take chamomile internally or apply externally. You can drink a cup of tea or use the oil, a cream, a compress, or a tea wash. In general, the uses are the following. Soporific and comative, it calms the central nervous system allowing you to relax, escape stress and fall asleep eases cramps and other digestive problems, it is antispasmodic. Drink it and feel relieved rashes and burns, a cream or compressed tea will help heal burns, sunburns or even rashes skin irritation, a chamomile-based cream is a common soother for such things as eczema, allergies and post-radiation skin damage infections, a chamomile wash can kill off several types of bacteria and fungi. There are a few precautions concerning the use of chamomile. If you have allergies associated with other composite plants such as ragweed, do not try chamomile. It is in the same family. 
If you have a blood clotting disorder, you need to stay clear of this plant. The same applies if you are taking any type of anticoagulant medication. Echinacea Echinacea has risen from relative obscurity to popularity in the past 15 years. This purple coneflower offers up its roots, leaves and rhizomes for usage in a variety of ways. Colds and flus, it boosts the immune system prior to a cold viral, bacterial and fungal infections, helps defeat minor lymphatic system and liver bronchitis canker sores earache shingles sinusitis sore throat. There are several precautions to consider when considering this plant. It is beneficial only in minor immune system problems. For chronic immune or autoimmune diseases consult a doctor. Be very careful with your drug combinations as well as watch for allergies. Do not use for more than 8 weeks. Epsom salt Epsom salt is a mineral substance, magnesium sulfate. This is the active ingredient in many forms of laxatives. Epsom salt is, however, mainly for external usage. Internal usage is combined to commercial products that use Epsom salts in conjunction with other substances. In general, the main uses of Epsom salt are splinters and stingers, and Epsom soak will draw them out. It will works quicker as a paste pours, using Epsom salt in warm water removes blackheads and dead skin, producing a fresh look muscles, in a hot bath, it eases sore and tired muscles sprains and bruises, a warm bath reduces the swelling hemorrhoids, helps to shrink the swollen tissue softens skin, as a massage tool, it exfoliates. Epsom salt is a safe product except when applied externally. Although it may be ingested to soften stools, the result can be excessive diarrhea and abdominal cramps. It is best to avoid this usage altogether. Garlic There have been many studies done on the uses and possible uses of garlic as a medicine. Garlic does contain some useful substances including allin that turns into allicin when the bulb is crushed and or chewed. This is probably an antibiotic and has possible heart benefits. There are some roles garlic plays in medicine for which there is currently no known reason. Inhibits liver production of cholesterol improves blood flow through the body a cancer fighter using diallyl trisulfide wounds, apply crushed to wounds also effective against some fungi and bacteria including tuberculosis and E. coli. Colds and flu. Garlic is more effective fresh and raw than cooked. Barring the consequences of having garlic breath, it seems to lack cautionary measures. Ginger Ginger contains both gingerol and shagol. It is accommodative and available in root, powder and even capsule form. There is ginger tea, ginger root, crystallized and candied ginger and even real ginger ale. You can take ginger internally or apply it externally. It is best used for. Nausea, prevents it, ingest to help prevent it before you feel sick stomach, soothes an upset stomach migraines, at the first indication of a migraine or a severe headache, swallow some ginger to decrease the symptoms blood clots, thins out blood without stomach upset ease arthritic pain stuffiness, the smell reduce cholesterol, lowers blood pressure, can possible reduce menstrual cramps, antispasmodic properties relieves cramps. Do not use ginger if you are pregnant. If you have gallstones do not use ginger root. Ginseng Ginseng is a common root in Asia and North America popular in the Far East and Europe but gaining ground in North America. Panax Ginseng is grown in Korea and North America. True Ginseng contains genenocides and is an adaptogen. Uses include. Stress reduction reduces cholesterol increases energy, stimulates the nervous system sometimes an ingredient in energy drinks aphrodisiac, sexual enhancer, used to bolster male virility. Ginseng tends to be incompatible with vitamin C. Vitamin C interferes with the absorption of ginseng. If you have high blood pressure, a heart condition or an anxiety disorder, do not take ginseng. If you are postmenopausal, it could cause bleeding. Do not take it with other stimulant herbs. You should also decrease or even restrict your intake of caffeine. Golden Seal Golden Seal contains hydrastine, an infection fighter and berberine. The latter ingredient prevents diarrhea causing germs from adhering to the gastrointestinal system. It can be used both internally and externally. The following are the most common usages. Flus and colds, take at first sign to fend off urinary tract infections, antibiotic characteristics infectious diarrhea, berberine destroys warts, use a diluted tincture eyes soother, use as an eye wash to reduce and remove strain. Golden seal is a member of the daisy family together with ragweed and chamomile. If you are allergic to either of these plants, avoid golden seal. 
You should also not use golden seal if you are hypoglycemous, have high blood pressure, or suffer from a weak digestive system or autoimmune disease. If you are on golden seal, do not remain so for longer than one week. To continue usage after this period is to cause a reduction in the absorption of vitamin B12 by your body. Honey Honey is a substance containing hydrogen peroxide, propolis, both bacteria slayers and high levels of fructose. It is considered by many to be a sweet treat. It and its by-products are in candles, desserts and various forms of medicine. The reasons for using honey extend beyond its availability and cost. They are. Incisions, applied to a cut or wound, it will promote rapid healing burns, used on burns to heal quicker with less pain and little scarring ulcers, honey reduces and speeds the healing of ulcers gastrointestinal problems, promotes regularity. Honey has no known side effects among adults. It does have an age restriction. You should not give anyone under the age of one honey because of the content and type of spores. Lavender The sweet smell of lavender can easily fill a room. Its ability to cure lies in its tannin. Lavender flowers find their way into cookies and other baked goods. There are the dried flowers used in fragrant potpourris and the essence of the plant in lavender oil. You can massage lavender into the skin or burn its oil. Use the recommended means and dosage in a variety of ways. Sedative, lavender helps you calm down. It soothes the nerves. Use the oil in a diffuser, the aroma of the actual plant, or drop a few petals or oil into bath water. You can soothe using lavender massage oils as well headache, find relief by dabbing the oil onto each temple stomach ache, lavender tea acts as a digestive aid, easing the stomach infection, kills bacteria and prevents infection on minor cuts and scrapes soothes the ears, fights infection and itch from swimmers ear pain reliever, rub on and it will reduce pains from minor wounds while its anti-inflammatory actions help decrease itching touted as a possible cancer cure. Lemon The much maligned lemon, it is the butt of many a sweet and sour joke. This vitamin C-packed fruit contains the antioxidant powers of vitamin C together with citric acid, bioflavonoid, specifically rutin, and limonene for anti-tumor activity. Used internally or externally, lemons act to help in a variety of ways including Colds, vitamin content helps fight off colds and coughs heart diseases, protects against kidney stones, reduces calcium secretion in the kidney therefore preventing formation of stones veins, strengthens the walls of both capillaries and veins tumors, helps to reduce breast tumors, distinct possibility beauty uses include bleaching out of freckles and the fading of age spots, also heals acne skin cancer, lemon tea helps fight off. Mustard Mustard contains expectorants and irritants such as myrosin and sinagrin as well as being a rubefacient. Used externally, mustard seeds in packs and baths can take care of several different health issues. These include Colds and stuffy noses, use the smell of mustard to clear sinuses and unclogged noses, or apply a mustard pack to the chest Raynard's disease, this circulatory problem can be treated with a mustard compress stimulates the appetite athlete's foot, a foot bath will help relieve the itching back and joint pain, it is an ingredient in many types of arthritis liniments or unguent, use a mustard plaster headache, fever or congestion, place a cloth in tea and place on the affected part induce vomiting. Mustard does come with some cautions. If you use it for a prolonged period, it can burn your skin. If you take it internally, beware of a laxative effect or possible vomiting. Peppermint Peppermint is a favorite flavor for gum and other types of candies. Real peppermint contains menthol and methone. It is antispasmodic and antibiotic. It is frequently used in oral hygiene and digestive matters. It acts to help in a variety of ways. Digestive problems, helps aid stomach settlement and reduce flatulence gall stones, helps them dissolve nausea, reduces mild cases of ulcers, relieves pain and helps them heal congestion, drink tea or smell the plant to help reduce and relieve headaches, dab oil or tea on forehead and temples mouthwash, gargle with tea. Avoid peppermint if you have heartburn frequently. Always dilute peppermint oil before using. Petroleum Jelly Petroleum Jelly, often marketed as Vaseline, is a petroleum byproduct. It is for external use. Its major focus is on repairing and treating skin problems including Skin protection, traps moisture next to the skin prevent wind burn, acts as a protective barrier psoriasis, lubricates the skin eliminate head lice, applied thickly to the scalp then remove with baby oil taking all the head lice with it smooths and soothes sore lips scrapes and cuts, eases soreness and helps healing burns, moisturizes them but use only after the burn has cooled down. 
Street. John's wort St. John's wort Hypericum contains many different polyphenols, flavonoids, PHS nolic acids and naphthodianthrones. Active ingredients include hypericin, pseudohypericin and hyperforin. St. John's wort is used in several different ways and treatments. Below is a partial list. Depression, St. John's wort is used to treat mild depression in children and adolescents and in instances where cost is a major factor boils bruises carpal tunnel syndrome seasonal affective disorders sunburn. It may take several weeks to take effect. A major problem with the plant is it makes the skin light sensitive. If you take St. John's wort, do not ingest alcohol or any over-the-counter cold medications. You must also be careful what prescription medicines you are taking. This includes any drugs addressing high blood pressure and antidepressants. You must also not take it as you are pregnant. Vinegar Vinegar is acetic acid. It comes in different types from different sources. The most common is wine vinegar, cider vinegar and white grain vinegar. Vinegar is a common home remedy for Athlete's foot and swimmer's ear, fights fungi and bacteria settles stomach, if the stomach lacks acid but not if there is too much stomach acid sunburn, cools skin and reduces itch freshens clothing, sprinkle on or wash in stings and bites, relieves itches and removes pain headache, an old folk remedy is to soak brown paper in vinegar and place it on your head throat soother, gargle or as part of a cough syrup. Witch Hazel Witch Hazel has a long history of curing in North America. It also has powers as a water finder, dowsing. It is used externally in a number of reasons including Hemorrhoid relief, applied to the affected area poison ivy, splash skin with, eases the itch temporarily shaving cuts, disinfects and helps to clot the bleeding freshen skin sunburn inflammation insect bites, apply directly. There are no particular problems using commercial witch hazel externally. Yogurt Yogurt contains live bacteria, or at least the active yogurt does. It includes digestible calcium as well as lactose in its makeup. Yogurt has long been considered a healthy food. It also is effective against a number of health issues. These include Diarrhea, antibiotic-related types only. Increases the bacteria in the gut to restore balance infant diarrhea, reduces yeast infections, eat to get rid of bladder, protects immunity system, strengthens combat cancer bones, builds strong bones without worrying about lactose intolerance. Yogurt has no significant negative effects. However, if you wish to ensure the best effects possible look for live or active cultures in the yogurt. Conclusion There are many different types of home remedies. The top 20 illustrate some of the most common ones. They encompass plants, minerals and human constructed substances. While they have significant effects on improving or protecting your health, you need to be aware of possible side effects and cautionary issues. Always be aware of the specific dosage. Make sure you know whether the best and safest effects are achieved through internal or external use. Know the possible side effects and always talk to your doctor or other health professional. He or she can help you decide which herb or other substance will be the most effective in your particular instance.